Hey, what's up? Today I want to do a two-year review of my planter greenhouse. It's a 10 by 20. I don't remember what the model name is, but uh, we got it two years ago. Since we had a storm, we actually had several storms, but we had a particular one. But, uh, just closing the door. Uh, it did power outages that lasted 11 days for like hydro to recover and uh, we have just planted the uh, seedlings into the ground and the wind like wrapped them off the ground we had to like go find them and plant them the next day many trees came down I think the winds were like a hundred and something kilometers per hour I don't want to say a number because uh, I don't know for sure but uh, it's been two years and uh, the thing has held up amazing and uh, my understanding is that the, the uh, new models have a different uh, door system than this one but uh, it's like minus seven right now outside and, uh, we have a heater going here, and uh, it's nine degrees in here. And we got some tomatoes, leathers, parsley. We're keeping a bunch of citrus plants here for the winter. And this are not doing all that good, but uh, these are peppers. And we haven't like really tried to grow stuff. This is the first year that we tried to grow something, see what happens, uh, or what temperature we need to keep it, and uh, how much water we have to use because the uh, the heater will like dry it up, but then it gets humid, so it's different than normal. We we're trying to learn that. Uh, Heater we also bought from uh, Planta, and uh, I have that piece on top of it because uh, I don't. It hasn't happened with um, any like dripping from the snow melting, but in, uh, during the summer when it rains, some uh, water will drip here and there, and uh, the original heater that I got, I had left it directly under when it dripped and they got fried and uh, the, uh, the people of Planta actually uh, send me a new one so like their customer service is amazing but um, this is uh, the structure I put the shelves there and I have a electrical panel with uh, 60 amps and, uh, but yeah and uh, Two years later, this thing is still like new. Um, it's a bit of condensation trapped in here. This is probably because I didn't properly seal the ends of this, but other than that, uh, it's exactly like when I put it together. And, uh, anyways, we keep stuff here that uh, we don't want to leave out there to freeze. Uh, and I have uh, there's five fig trees here that we also winterize and uh, that's what I mean by uh, trying to guess how much water these are citrus plants uh, lemons and lime I think uh, sometimes it will be like a week before you need to water and uh, sometimes it depends how cold it gets and the, the heater runs and uh, dries up and from one day to the next you have to water again so we're just trying to guess that but uh, this is mainly about the uh, the greenhouse again uh, this is uh, 10 by 20 and uh, we love it so uh, I did a lot of research before getting one 
Uh, there's a couple things in the instructions, for example, I haven't fixed it yet, but there's a hole here, and uh, I cut this to the instructions. Um, I mean, I can just put like a piece of tape or something there, but even though it has gaps, as you can see, like there and along the top of the door, um, there's tape here, but this is. Uh, actually has nothing to do with uh, weather. There was uh, wasps that were trying to build a nest there and I put a tape to stop them from going in. But uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, leave me a comment. I'll try to answer it for you. And uh, I'll leave a link in the description for uh, Planta Greenhouses. Um, anyways, I hope that helped you out. If you're looking for one, uh, these things are great. Take care. Ciao, ciao.